I'm uh, here in the water cube with uh, sorry, Kusum, Kisum, Kusum, who's with the Women for Water Partnership. Uh, Kusum, could you please explain a little bit about uh, yourself and, and what you're doing here in Stockholm? Well, uh, this actually is my 14th World Water Forum. Wow. I first came uh, with, a pro with a paper on gender and water, which I think was also the first on gender and water for the Stockholm Water Forum. Yeah. So I think that a lot of the work that I've been doing on is on gender and water mm -hmm. and uh, therefore I'm a little unhappy that gender and water seems to have fallen off the radar yeah. right now for this particular forum. Yeah. And uh, But basically what I do is I work as a consultant, I work as an uh, advocacy uh, person and I work as a volunteer in water. Okay. And the issues that are coming on board, the urban rural migration, how it adds to the uh, the urban problem, you mm -hmm. know, urban problems I think are not caused by anything except rural inequities. Yeah. And so you've been here 14 times, but there has been movement when it comes to gender and water, or has it? Yes, I think there's been an up and a down. Mm -hmm. In '96, it was uh, uh, not very apparent. Then interest started building up. In the early 2000s, there was a, a, a peak. Now, perhaps uh, the tailing off of interest. Yeah. I, it's, for me also, it is curious. Mm -hmm. You know, is it part of the you know the up and down of uh, you know interest of, uh, and uh, or the inactivity of major groups such as women? Yeah. Maybe we have not done our work too well. Mm -hmm. We need to be a little more efficient uh, in how we have formulated and presented yeah. the issues. Yeah. Yeah, no, you're right. It has been, uh, I, I mean, I've, there's not many sessions this week uh, on uh, gender and water. And uh, hardly any papers. And hardly any papers. So, I mean, uh, is your message to the world then, to get gender back on the agenda, would be? The, it's not a matter of only equity. It's also a matter of efficiency. Yeah. One can hardly solve the world's problems in water mm -hmm. if you leave out half of humanity. That yeah. is basic. That's, that's and and when you do uh, try to solve the problems, it also means that you have to look at women's organizations who are working in the issue, such as the Women for Water Partnership. Mm -hmm, definitely. And, uh, goodwill is not enough. Financing has to go into women's organizations. And I think this is uh, the message that I have to give to all donors. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you very much. Let's hope that next year gender has gone back on a couple of the, you know, the agenda and uh, well. I think that next year what we have to say is if you are unhappy with the term don't call it gender, just call it optimization of human resources, you still would get there. <laughs> Sounds like a good idea. Okay, thank you very much for this interview. Thank you.